A health scare on a cruise ship, a cruise line backs out of Australia, and a new ship floats out. Cruise News Today starts now. From Las Vegas, this is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. Good morning. Here's your cruise news for Tuesday, February 27th. After initially being denied entry into a port in East Africa over the weekend due to concerns about potential health risks, including a possible cholera outbreak, the Norwegian Dawn received permission to dock at its main port on Monday. Officials from the Port Authority had kept the ship out of the port following its early arrival Saturday evening, citing precautionary measures. However, after sample testing was conducted by the Ministry of Health and Wellness, there was no evidence of cholera on board and the vessel was eventually cleared for entry. The following cruise was delayed one day and the cruise line provided compensation to those guests. And Virgin Voyages has decided to cancel its late 2024 and early 2025 Australia season for the Resilient Lady, repositioning the ship over to the Caribbean instead. This shift follows the recent rerouting of the Resilient Lady's upcoming voyages from Australia back to the Mediterranean due to concerns about security risks in the Red Sea region. The Resilient Lady will now conclude its Mediterranean season in October and then embark on a series of cruises from San Juan, Puerto Rico to the Eastern and Southern Caribbean. Impacted guests or sailings that were canceled will be receiving refunds or other options from Virgin Voyages. And Silver Sea Cruises marked a milestone on Sunday morning with the float-out ceremony of its newest ship, the Silver Ray, at the Meyerwerf shipyard in Poppenburg, Germany. As the cruise line's second Nova-class vessel, the Silver Ray will join sister ship Silver Nova as the largest ship in the Silver Sea fleet. It's scheduled for launch this summer over in Europe. And cruise line stocks were down on Monday. My teleprompter just crashed. Carnival Corporation down 3%, 14.78. Royal Caribbean down 2%, 119.57. And Norwegian down 1.5%, 15.93. If you have a lead on a story, send it our way. Tips at cruise radio.net. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today. Have yourself a great Tuesday.